My name is John David Cronix. I go by JD. And it's, it's my belief uh, that in order to understand how to truly apply spatial technologies to a particular area, whether it's transportation or health or some other area, you need to understand that area to some degree and you need to understand the problems that people in that area face. Each week, we will look at a particular transportation organization. So we'll look at one week, we'll look at the Federal Highways Administration. Another week, we'll look at a state Department of Transportation, a state DOT. Uh, AASHTO is an important organization in transportation. So by the end of the course, uh, you'll have a flavor for the important players in the transportation industry and, and those organizations that uh, utilize spatial technologies in transportation. Another component of the course that uh, I think I've gotten a lot of positive feedback on is each week we have a webinar uh, with a professional in the transportation industry, uh, generally people that use spatial technologies in transportation. So, for example, in the last co course offering, we actually had 13 uh, presentations from different uh, transportation professionals. These were interactive presentations where the students could ask questions, um, and I know the students that have taken the course uh, each time I've offered it have really liked that aspect of the course. Um, and, and also, uh, one, one other thing I've really tried to focus on in the course, because I am myself a graduate of the uh, MGIS program through Penn State, an online program, is I've tried to structure things in a way that we, uh, you know, kind of close the gap between some of the online experience and classroom experience. So I think the webinars themselves, the live interactive webinars, that we have each week, you know, to give the students a chance to interact live with each other and myself and the transportation professionals. And also I typically have one-on-one -on -one sessions each week where I ask students to pair up and interact with each other in one-on-one -on -one sessions for a half an hour to get to know each other. So I really look forward to meeting you in the class and uh, I hope we have fun together.